It's time for another style file and this week I have loads of fashion, celebrities and beauty for you. We'll be looking at a brand new makeup brand, Ella Masca, that's just landed in Glasgow. And in our photo shoot, we're focusing on coral fashion this week. It's one of the hottest colours for summer 2009. But first of all, let's have a look as always to Hollywood and see what A-listers are looking hot this week. First of all, it's Miley Cyrus looking fantastic in this bright pink cardi. Get to a look at Dorothy Perkins, teamed with some great shoes from June and a statement necklace from Accessorize. But at the top of my most stylish list this week was Kat Dealey looking hot in this little black dress. Get her look with this cutout number from Miss Selfridge, teamed with some hot heels from Office. It's time to head over to Debenhams in Glasgow now to have a look at the hottest new makeup range in town, Ella Masca. Katy Perry, Lily Allen and Sienna Miller are just a few of the celebrity fans of this exclusive new makeup range, Ella Masca. It launched in Selfridges in London in November and now it's hit Scotland. Here in Debenhams we have the whole fantastic range of great high pigment colours and an amazing lash bar which we're going to have a look at. So I've picked out these fabulous winged lashes to wear tonight and Shan is going to give us a step-by-step -step guide on how to apply them. So where do we start? Okay, first of all what you want to do is you want to remove your lashes from the card but you want to check the length of them. Just by holding them in front of your eye you can see how long they are in comparison to the length of your eye and then just trim them to fit. Okay. okay. And then what you want to do is holding your lashes with a pair of tweezers is then just apply the glue along the lash line. Okay. So first we trim and then we glue. Yes. And you just want to apply a very, very fine line of glue. Mm -hmm. And this will dry clear once it's set. So you won't be able to see it. Okay, and then to apply the lashes, you want to go as close to your natural lash line as you can. And starting in the middle, and then pressing the ends in place. How long do you have to do this to, to make sure it's... How long do you have to do this for it? Basically, once you apply the glue, if you wait a few seconds just to make sure it's tacky mm -hmm. before you apply them, and then just apply them into place. Keep your eyes closed for another sort of 10 seconds just to make sure they're stuck. And then if you open for me, it's fine, and close again and then just make sure your ends are well stuck down. Okay. Perfect. Are we done? We're done on okay. that eye. Right? Okay. You. So then we're so going to... So all we need to do is the same thing to the other same eye? Same thing on the other eye. So again, just applying your glue along the light lash line and then just sticking it into place. mistakes that people make when trying to apply lashes? Quite often people will put too much glue onto the lash and when they then try to apply it to the eye it's just going to slip around and slide okay. out of place. It makes it much more difficult to get them to stick. So your best thing is less is more with the glue. And then can you reuse these? Absolutely. Just when you remove them, if you just clean them off with a little bit of eye makeup remover. Mm -hmm and then you can store them back in the container that they came in originally. And does and that help keep them. their shape if you store them in the original yeah. container? Yeah, that's going to help keep the, the nice curved shape to them and it's going to help to protect the hairs as well. If you just open your eye again. Beautiful. There you go. What do you think of that? Our shoot this week is based around the colour coral, one of the hottest hues on the high street. And our shoot is going to take place down at Hummingbird Nightclub in Glasgow. It's a fantastic venue. Now, before we go there though, let me show you my top five coral buys. So we'll start with this great dress here from Reese, £149. Pretty pricey, but this is the kind of dress that would be perfect for going to a summer wedding. Another one here is a more casual version this time from Topshop. This really cute cotton number is perfect for your holidays and it's just £40 that one. And what about this for a bargain? Pre-mark, 
£11 for this great skirt. Now, as you can see, coral looks great teamed with these shades of nude and beige here. So that's the way to wear it if you don't want to go all over coral. Now, what about accessories? How about these great hot heels from Office? Great way to brighten up your outfit if you don't want to wear coral clothes. And another one, this cute clutch bag here from Reese. 139 for this one, so pretty pricey, but a really classy way to wear that coral colour. So that's my top five buys. Let's head over to Hummingbird and see how our model's getting on. That's it for Style File this time, but don't forget you can get regular fashion updates on my blog on the Daily Record website. And if you're still in the mood for a fashion fix, don't miss our great Daily Record Fashion Fix Roadshows. We're in Edinburgh on Sunday the 24th in St Andrews Square and the following weekend we're in St Enoch Centre in Glasgow. Until then, happy shopping!